Okay, good evening, people. Good evening. How are you tonight? How was your day? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Uh -huh. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome one more time to our English Corporativo class with pre-intermediate one. So we are on our second week. We're ready to start. Okay. Okay, last class we we finished talking about prepositions of time, yes? Yes. Mm -hmm. So, and we learn how to use at, in, and on when we talk about time. So you have an exercise to complete. And now we are going to check it, okay? I gave you 10 sentences. Good evening. Good evening. I gave you 10 sentences to complete with the correct preposition. Okay. So let's get started with that tonight. One more time. Welcome, everyone. And let's see. Let me share the screen to check your work. Okay, here it is. So we studied these prepositions. And we learned that we use at for very specific time. Okay. Uh, in for parts of the day, month, seasons, years, decades, and a period of time. And on for days, day and part of the day, specific days, dates. Okay, in those cases we are going to use on. So, uh -oh. Now the exercise. Okay, um, let me start with who? Luis, Luis, can you read the, can you read sentence number one, please, with the correct preposition? 
Good evening, teacher. Good evening. At. Please read the, the sentence. Yeah, uh, we're going to have a party at Friday night. Friday night. Uh, Friday night. What What do you Friday think, night. Gabriel? Is at the correct preposition in that case? Gabriela, I'm sorry, Gabriela. No. Uh, what, what number, teacher? Number one. Luis says okay. that the uh, preposition is where at. We are going to what party at the night, at Friday night? At uh, Friday night. Uh huh. What do you think, Roger? Is at? No, it's on. Um, we're going to have a party on Friday night. Yes, it is on on Friday night. Mm -hmm. Remember that we use on when we talk about a day and part of the day. Yeah. Yes. Sir. Okay. <clears throat> so this one is. Let me use capital letter to on. Okay, number two. Let me ask to Flor Rodriguez. Can you read number two, please? Hi, teacher. Hello. Hola, teacher. teacher. Hello, good evening. Give me a second. We are we are working on the exercise. And right now, Flor is going to read sentence number two with the correct answer. Yeah, teacher. Eh, teacher, yo estoy trabajando todavía, así que solo voy a escuchar. Okay, no problem. Do you have the answer, Flor? Y ese que no entiendo, ese me acabo de conectar y ahí, la clase de ayer no la vi, no sé si vieron esto, no entiendo qué están haciendo. Ah, ok, ok, no problem, no problem, ok. Teacher, Just... eh, the meeting is at 4. Ok, the meeting is at... at. Uh -huh. Okay, the meeting is at 4 p.m., correct. Number three, let me ask to Irma. Number three, Irma, can you read? Uh, Sam's birthday, okay, okay. Sam's birthday is next weekend on October 5th. Yes, perfect. October 5th. Yeah, estaba bien, ah, okay. como dijo, October 5th. <laughs> sí, lo siento, okay, 5th. No, okay. no hay problema. Okay, very good. Uh, let's see, Mary, can you read number four? Mary. Sorry, teacher, tengo problemas de audio. Ah, no, nosotros lo escuchamos bien. Okay. For me. Yes. My, my grandfather was born in the 1950. Yes, in, perfect, in mm. the 1950s. Correct. Mm. Number five, Erica, can you read number five, please? My family and I, I go to the beach in summer. Yes, correct. In summer. Excellent. Let me see who else. Okay, Omar, please, number six. Number six, my family and I go that's, to the beach. That's, that's number five. No, six. Uh-huh. Are there any holidays in March? 
Yes, excellent. In March. Roberto, number seven, please. Seven. Yes. Uh, the cafeteria open for lunch at, at noon. Correct. Excellent. Next is for... Uh, uh, Rosalia, number eight. Your microphone, Rosalia, please. Sorry. No, no problem. Okay. What time do you go to bed at night? Excellent. Yes. Number nine. Let me ask to Joel. Number nine, Joel. We moved to another country in 2015. Yes, correct. And number 10, let me see, Julia, can you read number 10, please? Uh, the concert starts at midnight, that's past my bedtime. Yes, correct, at. Very good. Let's practice the pronunciation of these sentences, please. Open your mix and repeat after me. We're going to have a party on Friday night. We're going to have a party on Friday night. Friday night. Number two, the meeting is at 4 p.m. The meeting is at 4 p.m. Okay, remember the meeting. The meeting. That meeting. Sam's birthday is next weekend on October 5th. Sam's birthday is next weekend on October 5th. My grandfather was born in the 1950s. My grandfather was born in the 1950s. My grandfather was born in the 1950s. Five. My family and I go to the beach in summer. My family and I, I go to the beach in summer. Todas esas ya me mandó todas, excepto una nueva que ya llegó. Que ya llegó, pues dígale que no, que se regrese. Si alguien tiene alguna conversación por ahí, no hay problema, solo apague su micrófono y... Y luego se integra, por favor. Gracias. Six. Are there any no, holidays? No, discusión hoy. Yeah. Are there, 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 <laughs> Seven. The cafeteria opens for lunch at noon. Ah, okay. The cafeteria opens at noon. Eight. What time do you go to bed at night? What time do you go to bed at night? Nine. We moved to another country in 2015. We are moving to another country in 2015. Moved. 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 
concert. And the concert starts at midnight. At past my bedtime. The concert. The concert starts at midnight. That's my bedtime. Okay. Starts. Repeat. Starts. 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 Okay. Uh, be careful with the pronunciation of that word because uh, in, we tend to say a start. And it's not a start, it is starts. Yeah, eso nos pasa a los que hablamos Starts. 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 Hispano hablando. Starts. Like a plural. Yeah. No, el problema es este, por ejemplo, con palabras como esta. ¿Cómo se lee eso que acabo de escribir? Hola, es Stop. 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 Ah. Stop. 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 El problema es que... En el, ah, el tema ubicación de los primeros suelos en esta clase trabajamos en la página 130 del libro que trata sobre la ubicación de los primeros a veces tendemos a colocar una E aquí los que hablamos español que no tenemos casi palabras que empiecen de esa manera ese consonante ¿Verdad? Tendemos a poner una E al pronunciar y decimos stop. O decimos, por ejemplo, snake. ¿Verdad? Y ponemos esa E. O decimos stadium. ¿Verdad? Y esa E tenemos que eliminarla. Esa E tenemos que eliminarla de nuestra pronunciación. Nada más hacerles ver eso, ¿verdad? A la hora de pronunciar palabras como esta, starts, okay. stop, snake, stadium. Okay, very good. Uh, let me raise that and we'll continue with the next topic, okay? Well, any question with this uh, topic about prepositions of time? No, no, teacher. Okay, very good, very good. Well, then, <laughs> I have the extra still. So, next, we are going to start with section three. The name of section three is How Much Is It? How Much Is It? And the objective for the first lesson is... Uh, participants in this lesson participants will listen to a conversation about demonstratives while shopping okay demonstratives what are demonstratives okay let me show you in this conversation I'm going to uh, to read this conversation first okay and then uh, pay attention, just listen to the pronunciation and then we are going to practice. Okay, uh, listen. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. They are perfect for you. These red ones, I'm not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, these, hmm. Yellow isn't really a good color for me. Well, that necklace isn't bad. Which one? That blue one right there. How much is it? It's $42. That's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Thanks. Okay. Now, please open your mix, open your mix, and let's practice this conversation, okay? Turn on your microphone, Teacher. please. Okay. Uh -huh. Teacher, uh, what is neglish? Oh, yeah. 
Exactly. Necklace. No escuché. Collar. Ah, collar. Collar de diamantes. Así, así, cabal, hable como que está peleando con alguien, aunque no sea conmigo. No, pero no era yo, no era yo. No, no. Vaya, a, a, a quien lo dijo, pues gracias. Era la novela la que estaban oyendo por ahí. <risa> Era una película. Ok. Listen and repeat after me, please. Oh, look at this. Um, sorry. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. They're perfect oh, for oh. you. Oh, look, oh, look at those earrings, Maria. Yeah. Those earrings, Maria. They're perfect for you. They're perfect for you. Those red ones? These red ones? Yeah. These red ones? Oh, these red ones? These red ones? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. No, the yellow no. ones. No, the yellow ones. Oh, these? Oh, these? Oh, this, this, oh, this. Yellow isn't really yellow a good is color really for me. Yellow isn't really a good color for me. Okay, listen and then repeat, okay? Okay. Well, okay. That necklace isn't bad. Well, well, that, well necklace that necklace is bad. Bad. Which one? Which one? Which one? Which one? Which one? That blue one right there? How much is it? That the blue, blue one, one right, one right one there? there? How much, How much is it? How much? How much is it? It's forty-two dollars. That's expensive. It is forty-two dollars. That's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday! Hey, hey, let me get it for you. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Thanks. 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 Very good. Now, I am Steve and you are Maria. Okay? Okay. 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 I start. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. They are perfect for you. This red one. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, this. Oh, this. This is really a good for me. Well, that necklace isn't bad. Which one? Which one? That blue one right there. How much is it? It's forty-two dollars. That expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, very good. Now let's switch. You are Steve and I am Maria. So you begin. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, 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 these red ones? I'm not sure. No, no the, the yellow, yellow ones. ones. The yellow ones. Oh, these? Hmm. Yellow is really a good color for me. Which one? The blue, blue one right there. there. Yeah. 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 It's forty-two dollars. That's expensive. Hey, 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 Thanks. Okay, very good. Birthday. Forty-two. What? Birthday. Yeah. Will you pay forty-two dollars for an, a necklace? Yes. Yeah. Uh, maybe. Or more. No problem. No problem. Uh, no problem. It's a piece of cake. <laughs> ah. Okay. Now let me show you uh, this um, 
words. Those, those earrings, these, these red ones, these again here, that, that necklace, that again here, that's expensive, that. Okay. So these are what we call demonstrative adjectives, okay? Demonstrative. And let me show you something about, about that. I think you already know this, but let's talk a little bit about that, okay? Let me show you another slide. Okay, these are these demonstratives, okay? We have this and that. They are singular, okay? This and that are singular. We use this when something is close to a to us. Okay, when something is close to me, I use this. Okay, this. Yeah, this is my cell phone. This. Okay, but it's only one. When something is not close to me, I use that. Okay, for example, my cell phone is over there on another table. And I say, hey, that is my cell phone. That is only one, singular, not close, far. Yeah, that. The plural for this is these. Okay, these. When some things are close to me, and they are many, okay? For example, I, I could say, oh, these, one, two, and three, these are my markers. These are my markers, okay? They are close to me. But if they were far away from me, far from me, I say those are my markers okay they are far i cannot reach them those are my markers okay you can see that with these pictures this book here close that book there not close see the distance is different okay plural these books one, two books, these books, here, close, those books, far, there, not close, those books. Okay. Is this, is this clear for you? How pronunciation this it this close singular and plural? Okay, it's very similar, but the sound here is short. This. Okay. This. This. These. 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 Okay. Yeah. This, these, this, these. Sometimes in fast speaking could be difficult yeah, to see the difference, but uh, the, the, the noun is plural, must be plural, okay? For example, say these, when I say, this is my friend, uh, Ronald, 
okay? This is here, near to me. This is my friend Ronald, okay? Oh, these are my friends. You see the plural? These are my friends Ronald and John. These are my friends Ronald and John. So, plural. So, in a sentence, it's not difficult to make the difference. Okay, any other question? Porque these books lleva S al final. Si ya se sabe de que this es para plural. Yeah, because see, if you are talking in plural, mm -hmm. you are talking, you are going to describe plural objects. Object. Yeah. So you don't say in Spanish estos teléfono. That's incorrect. Yeah? Esas, esas casa. That's incorrect, right? So el número tiene que coincidir. Yeah? Okay. Now let me give you an exercise here. Okay, I give you some sentences in Spanish. And you have to translate them into English. Look at the example. Esta es nuestra nueva casa. In English, you say, this is our new house. See, this is our new house. Now, it's singular. It's here, you are here. No. And singular. Okay. So remember this, esta, close to you. Ahí en español ya sabemos cuáles significan cercanía y cuáles significan lejanía, ¿verdad? Okay. Okay, so uh -huh. I'm going to let me uh, send this picture to WhatsApp. I'm going to send the Screenshot to WhatsApp. And I'm going to put you in small groups to work on these exercises. To work on these sentences. You have to write them correctly in English. Okay. Oh, one, two, bueno, mañana va a ser la plática si va a definir o no la compra. Y si no la define, entonces no es de nosotros, mamá. Shh. Okay, please join the join the small groups and work on this exercise.
Five at HR. Uh -huh. Recursos humanos. ¿Cómo se, se, se Es que no sé si es human records o R, R, H. No sé. Human, re, human re, no. pero la, la, ¿cómo se escribe? Human la forma correcta. Espera, Ajá. No sé. Recursos humanos. Human resource. Human Re resource. Resource, creo que no. A ver cómo se pronuncia. Human resource. Ah, human resource. Files, ma. Files. Files. Ajá, files se escribe. Files. Estos, estos, la cuarta, no, 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 La cuatro, yo he puesto, that is the building of my office. Qué caro. Qué source. Número 7 dice que estos son los nuevos productos de la compañía. Entonces sería this these are the new products of the of company. Mm -hmm. Esto sería this. This. These are they uh, are the uh -huh. new products. Are the new of the company. Oh. Ocho, estas computadoras no están funcionando. Estas. Estas. Es. Estos son los nuevos productos de la compañía. Estos son los productos. Estos. Entonces sería this, that. This. Ah, sí, this. Estos. Es el producto. De la compañía. This, are, This is the new product, the company. Pero This, como son varias, son are. Are new product. These are the company. These are The new This product, the company. Entonces, ah, ah, no sé. Dos ar. Dos ar. Dos ar. Those are the human, human recursos. Es? Dice recursos. Recursos humanos. Recursos Ajá. Human resources. Human resources. Res. Yo le he puesto a cargar. 
Vos la descargaste, ¿verdad, Juan Pablo? Tenés que a descargarla y no la pones a cargar. Dale una babosa. Echale sal. Ya la vio. Sí. Ok, nos faltan dos, ¿verdad? Sí. Déjeme buscarlo. O sea que no la estás haciendo, no estás pensando, vos la estás buscando. Qué bonito. No, o sea, buscar la imagen. Sí, es tu sister María. Esa es tu hermana María. Sería... This. This. Uh -huh. this, this. Your sister María. Your sister María. This. Your Ahí estamos. Ajá. Ya, gracias. Ok. Ahí está, perfecto. Sí. Saúl. Hello, I'm checking your work here, but, well, number two. Number eight. 
these com computers are not working. Yeah, that's correct. Okay. Number three, okay, yeah, that. Number four, okay, all that. Number five, este, this. Number six, okay, those. those. Number seven, estos, these. Number eight, estas, these. Number nine, is that, uh huh. And number ten, those. Okay, this is our new house. Those are um, well, number two. Yeah, it's correct with the demonstrative. Those those are the teachers' books. Those um, are the teachers, no, the possessive, remember? The oh, uh-huh. Okay. The teachers. Uh, possessive, okay. not plural, possessive. Book. In teacher, teacher. Okay. Remember? Teacher. Uh-huh. Okay. Excellent. Teacher's books. Teacher's book. Okay. Books, because it's plural. Uh-huh. Miss okay. Michelangelo, that books okay. is oh. yeah. like office. Books ya no lleva ese, ¿verdad? Yes, yes, it's plural. Yes. This, that is mm -hmm. the building of my office. This is the sales report. Those are the human resources files. These are new products of the company. <coughs> um, these computers are not working. Uh, files are expensive. Uh, I would say these are the new products. The new products and the building. In number four. Number seven, the new products. And number four, the building. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Practice the pronunciation. Okay, you can take turns and practice the re reading the sentences while I go to visit other groups. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Do you, do you finish, people? Yes. Yes, sir. Any question? Any problem? Uh, I have a question for the number eight. Number eight, yeah. Which is the right form? For example, is this computer, it doesn't work or these computers are not running? Um, the, I would say these computers are not Mm -hmm. Working um, are not working. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. it's more easy. Yeah. Okay. Are not working. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Anything else? No, we're done. Okay, great. See you later. See you. Uh, practice reading the sentences aloud. Okay, so you can take turns and read one by one just to practice. Okay, okay. Did you finish, guys? Yes. 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 Any problem? Um, no, no. <laughs> no questions? Hasta ahorita, no? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. See you. Bye, Tincho.
I'm here. Okay. Hi. Well, welcome back. Let's check your work. Uh, who starts with number two? Okay. okay. And me, teacher. Okay. Roger. Okay, Roger. And number two, uh, those are the teacher books. Okay, good. Uh, can you read again, please? Those are the teacher books. Okay, just uh, perfect, but just the teachers. This adjective. Teachers. Ah, okay. Remember the possessive with apostrophe S. S. Uh -huh. uh, uh -huh. That indicates possessive. Okay. Okay, remember. But the teacher's book. Okay, thanks. Uh -huh. Perfect, very good. Roger, can you pass the ball, please? And Choose another student to read number three. Okay, let me see. Um, Erica. Okay. Erica Paulina. Erica, okay. number three. Number three, that is my friend Angela. Yes, excellent. Number four, I'll pass the ball, Erica. And Joel. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, the number four mm -hmm. that is the building of my office yeah that's very good uh, or that is the my office building that is my office building okay mm -hmm. um now pass the ball please okay give me a second um, miss julia Julia, number five. Uh, this, this is the sales report. Yes, excellent. The sales report. Uh -huh. This is the sales report. Okay. Report. Ah, uh, report. Yeah. Teacher. Yes. Uh, I have a question. In that case, uh, with the apostrophe and the with s no the possessive no ah uh, okay no okay thank you okay pass the ball julia and roberto okay <laughs> robert number six Robert. Your microphone. Oi. Now, yes. Yeah. Yes, number uh, six. Six. Mm -hmm. Those are the human resource fields. Okay, those are the human resources files. Those are human resources files. Okay. Possible, Robert. Olympia. Miss Olympia. Ya me extrañaba, no sé por qué. <laughs> sí, así me sentía rara. Gracias. Thank you. Number seven. These are the company and new products. Okay. Good. Um, uh, number eight. Uh, Gabriela. Gabriela. Um, this computer aren't working. Okay, good. Number Teacher. nine, yeah. In my case, no. I make the sentences. This computer are doesn't work. Is good or no? These computers doesn't work. Are doesn't work. Are doesn't work. No. Doesn't work. That's it. Yeah, but doesn't work is no funciona. No funciona. Uh huh. In the sentences no están funcionando. Uh huh. Okay. It's present, but it's, it's a little bit different, okay? Are not working. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. 
Okay, number nine. Thank okay, you, who was it? Gabriela, pass the ball, please. I pick uh, Alma. Alma. Number nine, Alma. Number nine. Yes. Is that your sister Maria? Yes, very good. Excellent. And then pass the ball for number 10, Alma. Adam. Adam. Adan, where is Adan? There it is. Adan. Hola. Number 10. Celia, mm, that, that tie is very expensive. No, that, that is, that is tie very expensive. Mm -hmm. Not really, not really. That, that tie is very expensive. It's plural. Mm, sí, son esas corbatas, entonces son das ties, those, those, those ties are very expensive. Yes, that's correct. Okay, that's correct. <laughs> okay, any question, people, with this? No. No question? No. Very good. Okay, we're going to stop here. Remember, uh -huh. Tell me. Para decir recursos humanos, ¿cómo queda? Human resources. Research. Resource. Our resources. Uh -huh. uh, finish yes. S. Yes, resources. Oh, okay. I have a question. Yes, tell me, Roger. Yeah. Eh, y no se, no hay una como una forma de abreviar recursos humanos. Oh yes, usually you're going to see HR. HR. Okay. HR. Okay. Any um, question? No. No. Nope. Finish me. Okay. No. Remember, please complete the the platform <laughs> section one, two, and three. Joel, you didn't send me your problems. Yeah, teacher, I don't have time all day. <laughs> uh -huh. You can do it tomorrow, okay? Yeah. And the mid-term exam also. You have to do it, okay? Well, bye-bye, okay. people. Okay. See you tomorrow. Oh, have a good night. <laughs> Yeah, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Happy Children's Day. <laughs> Thanks.